Sí. for a hotel. 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 Yeah. Hotel. Yeah. Is it fucking Magnolia Lane? See, I think these houses are empty. Yeah, those are pretty nice houses. At least it looks like it from over here. I think so. Montgomery. Yep, Montgomery. We're we actually going to be staying? Or? Yes, I think or so. We're going to be staying in all these little resorts, I guess. Yeah. Here's the view outside of Adam's room. Got the Mediterranean Sea right there. These rooms aren't quite as good as the other ones. Hello, boys. Here's Gene's room. We got two balconies. Oh, you've got the fucking romantic room. <laughs> a couple of hearts. Oh, it's like cute. a little mini apartment, and oh, there's cute. a kitchen thing back there. Oh, you definitely cool. got the best room. Yeah, I got the best out of the three. Huh? Except when it does rain, you're not going to sleep. Right? You've got one bed. Here is my room. Pretty basic room at the Papillon Aisha. I guess that's how you say it. <laughs> and looking out the balcony here. Rain again. Jeans over there on the corner. Oh, I got a nice view of the, the sea here. Can't really see it on camera though. So today uh, we it's a scheduled off day, but. Um, wanted to try and play the course today, <clears throat> but they won't, uh, it's closed, closed for us, and tomorrow's our official practice round day, so what we've been doing is just walking the course and uh, taking a wedge and a putter and just kind of just seeing the course and hitting a few putts and chips, and it uh, looks like a pretty nice course, but we just walked through the meat of the course, and it's playing dead into the wind, uh, par... Uh, I don't remember, but uh, there was one that was 440 and 420 meters, um, and it was into a really, really strong wind, so it would be a pretty tough one. <laughs> Looks like a good course, though. The nice thing about the, uh, the uh, <clears throat> greens is that uh, well, they're fast, and there's a lot of bumps. Um, but they, they're in really good condition, so if you hit a line, it'll hold the line. And uh, unlike the other two courses we just played where they tried to cut the, the grass so short that um, uh, when the cold front came through, uh, the grass just dried, uh, or it died. And then uh, with it being dry, it, 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 when we first got there, the course was in condition. It wasn't in as good a condition. Also, this course off the tee, it, ooh, there's like a little bit more room. Um, so it seems we've walked maybe, I guess we're on hole seven now. Uh, no, this is hole eight. And, uh, but yeah, there's none of these. Uh, it, it seems like on this course, unlike the other courses, that if, if you hit in the fairway, you're not going to be blocked out. Um, and you have a little bit more room to start the ball off. Out of, uh, from the tee also, so a little bit more uh, margin of error off the tee, which is nice. Well, it seems like all over Turkey here, there's a lot, looks like there's a lot of uh, development, but uh, so much of it is just unfinished. I mean, this is pretty
condos here just look abandoned. <laughs> this hotel here is pretty cool. Um, it's got, say, a pretty, uh, it's got a bigger, nicer lobby, I think, than the Sueno. Um, it's got a few uh, shops over there, a couple stores. Elevator with several floors, way up there, and they have a kind of a nice deal here. <clears throat> Everything is all included, so we can go over to the bar there and get whatever drinks we want. If we want to have a beer, we can just order it. Uh, if we want some food, uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner is all included here. It's really nice. Uh, it's a nice deal to just grab something whenever you want it without having to think about. Uh, paying it or putting it on your room card or anything else. It's kind of nice. This particular hotel has uh, a little bit more in the way of shops. Several shops down that way. Shopping center. Jewelry stores. This is where we can have uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, it's just a massive dining hall. Kind of like the other place. It's just eat whatever you want. They have all kinds of things laid out on these uh, Little islands here. Pretty cool. Oh, I forgot to mention also the room service is included, which is a bit unusual. Normally, uh, all the places I've been, you have to uh, pay for room service, but it's all it's all included with the room and all included with the package. It's pretty nice. Down through the the doorway there, I think the sea is right there. Let's go check it out and see how close the sea is. Here's where we were back in the uh, dining room. Looks like they got some pools out here. Uh, maybe some places for like some uh, concerts or something, outdoor activities. But again, it's like so much of this. And here's the uh, Mediterranean. That's just more crazy weather again. It's been raining off and on all day. The wind is blowing a lot right now. Normally, the sea out there. I don't know if you remember when I showed you the, the Mediterranean. Looks like there's a lot of stuff. It's all just uh, abandoned. I don't. I, I'd be curious to know what it's like in the summer here, but in the winter, it's just kind of just kind of dead. <laughs> they also have a nice little indoor pool and jacuzzi here. They've also got a uh, fitness center. Uh, this one's pretty decent. They got a fair amount of stuff here. They got some dumbbells and. This is a little bit better uh, gym than over at Sueno. And they have some ping pong. And like at the other place, they have a spa in here. Um, the uh, Turkish bath here is actually a little bit better. It's kind of neat. The other one smells a little bit, so I didn't go in that one too much. But the, the sauna over there at Sueno, I think, was a little bit better. I haven't been in this. I just peeked in the sauna. It looks pretty cool, but I think the other sauna over at Sueno is better. But this Turkish bath here, um, at Aisha that one is uh, a little bit better. Uh, it's not getting used right now, but they have a uh, bowling alley, which is pretty cool. Um, just two lanes here. So me and some of the uh, the guys are probably, in, at night when we're done practicing and the tournament's done, uh, we'll probably come down here and have a little uh, bowling competition. Uh, they also have another ping pong table over there. And where those chairs are, they have some darts and uh, there's also uh, an internet room down there uh, and a, like a little movie theater so where you can watch movies at night. <laughs>